How's it guys? Um, it's been a while since I've actually made a vlog. Things have just been really, really busy and I've sort of got a list of cars and people that I'd like to interview and, and speak to. Um, so first on the list, we're going to try and get a sneak peek of a car that they are busy with um, and then get sort of an updated version when it's done. I think it could be quite interesting. So let's see what they've got for me. So some of you would recognize that this is the Low Stud headquarters um, out in Cape Town. And we headed over to check out Donnie's uh, Mercedes C180 W204. It's a 2008 model, the compressor. And yeah, we're just sort of they in progress with this. And just hearing his backstory and how he went about choosing the car. Um, you, you know, kind of he had a Polo before, um, the Polo 6. and you know letting go of it was quite difficult for him i do acknowledge that um but really just choosing something that he felt was a little bit more classy uh, spacious and also a little bit more comfortable i really like the android deck that he's gone with after he was contacted by the guys from auto style uh, saying like you know contact us and see if we have something that you'd like um we'll sort you out and he went with something that i think plays amazingly it plays like a clear it's also nice and big up front which kind of looks at home in the mercedes he's also decided to change up the grill a bit might make it look more stealthy more aggressive change it to black we'll see what he decides The thing he noted was he said he's quite happy with you know the way the front wheels are sitting um, but that the back does seem a little bit lost in the arch um, arches so he's gonna probably be changing it up to 19. So you don't want to show me what wheel just yet but I mean you, you know he's quite uh, experienced um, with wheels and he's also got the right connections and people to assist him so I mean you can see how, how nice and snug it sits in there um, but even then it's gonna sit a bit lower and I think he said he wants to roll the arches and just get that wheel tucked in a little bit nicely. So Donnie's really itching to finish this sort of process because the car's been standing for a month, which I think is very uncharacteristic because normally they kick out the cars in a couple of days, but I know work commitments have been quite heavy. But again, I'm looking forward to seeing what they're going to be doing. Um, I know he's going, he said he prefers the switches over management, and I think that just comes down to personal preference also. I know the air components haven't been installed yet, so hopefully in the next two, three weeks I can do an update on this and we can see perhaps with a different wheel. Um, but again, I really like these cars. Actually, at one stage, wanted one myself. So in true fashion after catching up with him, load shedding said, get out of here, man. And the lights went off and I said to Donnie, goodbye, see you in a couple of weeks. How's it guys? So I'm back home. I, Donnie didn't want to be interviewed, which I respect. Um, he says not one for the camera. So we just did like an interview and, and really spoke about a few things, you know, plans of the car and why and how we came about to doing it. So really cool story and I will hopefully see them in the next couple of weeks to see the, the final product. I think it's going to look pretty cool. Thanks for watching.